John F. Kennedy Jr. was the handsome son of President Kennedy. He had many things in common with other members of his family, such as being a history buff and having political aspirations. While John may have not lived enough to fulfill those ambitions, he still is one of our favorites. Hi guys and welcome to Historically. In today's video, we will share with you six things you didn't know about him and how he could have looked like if he was alive today. Did you know that John F. Kennedy Jr. was often called John John? Well, that's because he was the youngest of the Kennedy children. He collected historical documents and letters from the time he was young until he died, which was an essential part of his character development as someone interested in history, politics, and government. You may not know this about John F. Kennedy Jr.'s political ambitions were often questioned. In 1992, he became a campaign advisor to his cousin, Joe Kennedy II, and worked on his congressional campaign. In 1994, he was named co-chair of the Committee for Unified Massachusetts, responsible for electing Michael Dukakis as governor of the state. But when it came time to endorse him in his Senate bid against the then U.S. Senator Ted Kennedy, John F. Kennedy Jr.'s name was nowhere to be found on the list. Only his cousins, Robert F., Caroline, and Edward M., all members of Congress today. They supported Dukakis's candidacy at the time as well. John F. Kennedy Jr.'s political aspirations continued into adulthood. However, many questioned whether or not he could succeed based on his last name alone, which prompted him to write an op-ed in the New York Times titled, Why I'm Not Running for Office. The article was meant as a response to those who criticized him for being naive about the amount of work involved with running for office and campaigning full-time without having any professional experience outside of journalism. He attended Brown University in Providence, Rhode Island. His major at Brown was political science. And while at Brown, he was a member of the crew team and sailed several times during his college career. He also pledged the Delta Kappa Epsilon fraternity and served as its vice president for two years before graduating from the university with high honors and a degree to show for it. He was born in the same hospital as his father and uncle, Massachusetts General Hospital. He was born on November 25, 1960. John F. Kennedy Jr. had a secret girlfriend that no one knew until Julie Baker decided to tell her story with JFK Jr. They had a relationship for two years and she described him as kind of silly, quirky, forgetful, fun and adventurous. After that, in 1996, he married Carolyn Bassett Kennedy. John F. Kennedy Jr. was a man of many talents, and we know him now as the handsome face of America's first family. But there are still plenty of things about his life you might not be aware. Like the fact that he was a passionate environmentalist who fought to protect our planet from harm. We hope this video has given you insight into JFK Jr.'s life and legacy and a greater appreciation for his contributions to society. That's all we had for today. Have a nice one.